Hello, folks. You see what I just did? Can you see it? You got you a little bit of ramen. I just put the beef ramen all in there with the jalapeno, the potato, and the onions. I got more tea going. And then, okay. And now look what we got, pal. Now, it's already Passover is past. <laughs> but folks, truth is, I did Passover like two months ago. You know? You guys used the wrong calendar. You guys used the calendar of the Medes and Persians. It's more important for you to look like a wannabe Jew than it is to be an actual just son of God. You know? My name's Chad, by the way. It's not Cod. Okay? I mean, if you call me that, I'm not going to be mad about it. Just like if you say Hamashiach, I'm not going to be mad or trip out about it. Just when I say Holy Spirit, we'll go, huh, and we both know what we're talking about. You know what I'm saying? Check out. I found out. Spot. See? On my helmet. Now check it out. Bang. Spice. I mean, because you know, when you're going to the chili cook-off or whatever, uh, you know, if society ever, no. Okay. The next chili cook-off, folks, is going to be in Zion. You get it? The next chili cook-off, folks, is going to be, and don't be even think about putting no pork in it, ladies. <laughs> We're keeping the law. So, it's always you ladies trying to feed us pork, man. What's up with that, dude? Gee, son, I don't know how we'd eat if we didn't break God's commandment. We have to break the law. I'd rather you break my teeth. <laughs> Not that we... That's what Jesus is for. None of us can say we've kept our way perfect. The glory to the Lord. Okay, folks. We just took real good care of that lamb, didn't we? You see that? And now I'm gonna check that out. Whoa, look at that, dude. You can't get any better than that. Okay, we're talking bank, dude. Right there, oh, here, you should, I should have, you know, I need a cameraman or something, but you know, you can get see that all nice and pretty, all sizzling on the deal, heck yeah, dude. Dude, what the hell's that, dude? Somebody just... Oh, he's whistling for his dog. <laughs> I got all tripped out. I thought I was in a riot. <laughs> I thought the prison riot was happening, but I thought we was back in the joint, man. All of a sudden, I heard dog whistles and shit. Thought they were coming in with the batons and the bat and the... Th anyway. Okay, folks. Um, what, do you, what do you think about that? Put a little... Wood on the fire. Put a little log on the fire. Put a little water on the beans. Dude, I made some sauerkraut too, man. And it's going to turn out bomb. I also just took some celery, you know? Put it in a jar, filled it with some vinegar. Put some spices in it. I hear things. We have people coming. You see that? There's people coming. I thought it was the man coming to sell us. I can just see commandos shooting out of black helicopters trying to stop me from eating my lunch. I mean, dude. You need to get out of here. You're not allowed to be here. Sir. I just want to get an, a more imposing insignia that says, Kingdom of God. Have it painted on my truck. Yeah? And, and just look at them and go, what? No, you! You know? And, and that, watch them just 
crap their pants. See the real true authority of God Almighty coming through one of his saints. Ah, Lord preserve us. I mean, that's, that's do you know what I mean in case you yeah, know what I mean. Sucks when you bunk with somebody so long in prison that you end up picking up their slang. I've caught up on so much of it, I can't even help it. You guys got to understand, I did a lot of prison time. Um, and um, my vocabulary slipped a little. <laughs> I learned, I picked up on some prison ebonics. Okay, but guess what? You guys are all about to learn some prison ebonics, aren't you? All y'all trapped up in your house until you get that dirty old mark of the beast. See, you know, on my hand, I got the mark of the king. That's right, Ad. The great living God lives in me, and because he's at my right hand, I won't be shook. Jesus is the Son of God. You know it's true. You know. Oh, dude. I mean, look at this, dude. I mean, am I got it going on? Or what? Is that kind of functioning right? I, like, like you was watching Bonanza or something? Or, you know, Gunsmoke? And they were out there having that and then you remember it's the apocalypse that oh dude are we getting a little bit long on time or am I just getting a little bit long winded that <laughs> Chad Buck Mr. Judah Dan Aleph Met 360 peace out from the apocalypse